All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to continue on with our next fight. We have FND Kalai in the red, and we have um, Alexander Liu in the blue. With me right here is Brian James Victor. Brian, how are you doing, Brian? I'm doing good, Daniel. Thank you for having me here. So, yeah, we have Alexander Liu in the blue. Aggressively oh, going for a takedown. Wow. A nice hip throw from Fendi Kalai. Yes, yes, a beautiful hip throw by Fendi Kalai here. We didn't even have time to, uh, to go into this intro here, and this fight is very really full of action. What? A hip throw from Afendi Kalai. You know, that's a really good test yeah. starting for this fight. So far, so good for the fighter in the red. That's how you know the fight's going to be really good then. So, a little bit of backstory. Afendi Kalai, the more veteran fighter, all the way from Mima Season 1. You know, he's been fighting all his life, all the way back from 2012 <laughs> and 2013. I think he's been fighting a little bit before that, when he was uh, a, Navy, a Navy boxer. Yes, so, sir. yeah. And Alexander Liu, a fighter that kind of came out of nowhere. You know, but he's been in the scene for uh, for a little bit. I have visited him quite a few times. Uh, yeah, fighting out of Fight Fam. You see, Fendi Kala here immediately going for a red naked choke here. I don't know. Guillotine. A guillotine. So sorry about that. A guillotine. It looks like it was deep, but uh, can't really see from the position here. But uh, yeah. yeah, don't mind the cameraman. Um, <laughs> so either way, back to a little bit of story, uh, a little bit of tale of the tape of this fight. Uh, Fendi Kala is a well, known as a boxer, mm -hmm. but trains out of GF team and has been competing in Copa and has been getting some medals. So definitely he's, from the uh, from the later seasons of Mima, has been showing a lot of improvement in his uh, grappling game. Uh, how do you fare the experiences from both fighters here? Well, um, as you were saying, Daniel, Fendi Kala here, I mean, I... I Fendi Kala here has been fighting for as, as far as I can remember, honestly. He's been fighting for more than like five plus years. Um, it'd be really, it's, it's a really good challenge for Alexander Liu here. Seeing how he, he just got out of that guillotine, he's, he's uh, taken top position. Uh, if I was in the shoes of Alexander here, um, it'd really be an honor and an experience to test his skill set. That's what Alexander said to me, actually. Oh. That's what he said to me when I went to visit his gym at Fight Fam and then he did a little bit in, uh, mm -hmm. over the interviews. Yeah, he's really psyched about this fight because he really cannot wait to test his skills against someone of, of uh, with, with accolades like Fendi Kalai. But now, yeah, from the top position, now moving on towards an armbar. Oh, that looks like a very tight armbar. It does. It does. Oh! What happened it, there? I think, I think Alexander took off, he, took off the arm because I think he thought that Fendi tapped. But Fendi saying that no, he didn't tap. And we go right back at it. Final 10 seconds of the very first round. Great work here by Alexander. Yeah. I mean, did you see a tap? Nah, it didn't look like a tap. It just looked like they were squirming around. And um, yeah, it's pretty much it actually. Well, we're going to continue with the fight. We're going to go to round number two right here. Fendi Kalai starting off real hot with big punches. Uh, nice combination there yeah. from Fendi Kalai. That's where you see his, his uh, boxing skills he developed when he first started fighting. In the uh, Navy, was it? Yeah, Navy boxing. Navy boxing team, I remember that very well. Only back then, and there we go for a quick takedown. Great work by Alexander here, honestly. There's something going on here. Is it something with his glove? I don't know. Get a closer look. I think it's something wrong with his elbow. Oh, I think he got injured there. Referee calls off the fight. Yeah, I think he, I think he dislocated his elbow there. Oh, it's oh, very no. unfortunate. Oh, he's trying to put it back in as well. Oh my lord. Oh, yes! Oh, I got again! <laughs> Did he really just dislocate his elbow? It seems like so. Like, his hand is he, really stiff. But he looks fine! I mean, you're fighting. Adrenaline's pumping. So, yeah. Oh, such a bummer though. Especially after you were just telling me about how hyped Alexander was for this fight. Yeah, but... Oh, no. There we go. That is the end of the fight. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Daniel Chi and I'm here with Brian James Victor. Well, catch us for till the next fight, MMA South Pop Malaysia.